Hi guys and welcome back to Ampersand Island. And um today for toy of the day is my hand. I put play doh all over it so it would look like this. <laughs> Let's see your other hand for comparison. This is comparison. Uh very beautiful, right? Giant universal monster mutated hand. <laughs> Very oh, yeah. nice. So, today... This is model magic, so I'll squish it around your hand. Yes. Oh, yeah. Okay, so... <laughs> so, for today, I was thinking, we were like... I didn't... I just wanted to do a video, and I didn't really know what I was going to do. But then I was, then I was like... Oh wait, I know, we can make my hand. And so I'm gonna draw this weird hand coming out of the sewers, like. So it's just like some sort of living hand? Yeah. Attached to some sort of mystery creature? Yeah, but no one really knows, they just see it. Yeah, is it like a sinister hand or does it just wave at people? <laughs> it just waves at people and people are very weirded out by it. Mm -hmm. So it's not like a specifically like, a yeah, a creepy thing. No. Just like pops out. It's just kind of terrifying because it like pops out. Like storm like... drains and sewer manholes and just yeah. waves and then goes back down. <laughs> yeah. And the people of the town are like, uh... Uh, And they don't really question it because they're just like, that's a little freaky. Or too freaky <laughs> for us. Got all the little lumpy doos on it. Mm-hmm. <laughs> so like, this one's like probably like... Hmm, what are some of the places in town? Well, you make a wave at somebody standing over here or something. Who should it be? I don't know. Um, you want to do that guy? Who? Just... No, someone that's already made on the island. Um, you can, uh, the tall, like, mouse down there of Stella's that she did okay. the other day. What's his name? Uh, Fred. Fred? Yeah. Fred has, like, got really long legs. That's Fred's big <laughs> thing that works at the mouse that works at the cheese factory. And steals cheese and has really long legs. Is it a girl or a boy? A boy, because his name is Fred. But hey, we decided, well, that's true. But uh, we also decided, because I forgot I already did Frank the mouse, and still I decided uh -huh. this was Fred, so we decided maybe they're like cousins? Yeah, they're like buddies. Like yeah. uh, Timmy and I were talking and uh, said, because he asked that question if they were related, and I thought, well, maybe that maybe. Uh, Fred is like the from the honeymooners, like or like, you know, from he's just like the big kind of dumb, <laughs> kind of not dumb, but just he's kind like of the, the gullible sin. tag along one. Yeah. And then short little like Frank is the one that's like calling all the shots and coming up with all the schemes. I could run and get Fred, but he's upstairs somewhere. Or Frank. And then we'll put like a building in the background. Yeah, you can just put something. Something. I'm just generic. <laughs> so put a house in the background. And there's like someone like staring out the window like Ooh. Actually now that I think about it, your hand is a little bit like Lester. There's like mysterious hands that yeah. hang around the town. So but we'll just assume that he does not have a dinosaur body. Yeah. There's like a random character just in the window fright fretting like, for his life. Like Ooh, what is that thing? You want to ink it? Yes. All right. With your one hand? Yeah. Make it all loopy. So it is sort of like a little bit like thing from the Adams family, only neon. Yeah, that's neon. what I was thinking about. Yeah. <laughs> you, I don't have like watercolors never come out as neon as that, so you're going to have to like... Yeah. Uh, I'm just going to have to make it yellow with a little bit of green on the bottom. And oh, I have a nice green for those uh, fingertips, though. Yes, a nice turquoise. That what, like viridian green or whatever they call it. What is it? A viridian hue. This one right here. Viridian hue. There we go. And that's like an, already an instant return for... Uh, What's for thing? Fred? Yeah. I have to do this one with one hand, so it might look a little sloppy. <laughs> do you usually draw two-handed? Like no. You're stirring a pot. Is the hand like I usually to... like hold it. Like. Yeah, I know. So do I. Otherwise, the paper slides. 
<laughs> Does it look creepy from the overview? Mm, uh, you keep drawing, you're fine. <laughs> Let me see if I can. Very nice. Would you be terrified if you found this hand in the middle of the street? Um, yes. <laughs> Just pop out of sewers. Mm hmm. It's, it looks pretty big than everything else, too, Dad. Dad. Yeah, I agree. Or is that just forced perspective? Like it's way in the foreground? Uh, yeah, it almost looks like the mouse is standing right next to it. Yeah. Like it's like a giant Godzilla sized hand. This is it bursting is. from the earth. It is, it is. Oh, so it's not coming out of vents. It's like a hand that just bursts through the ground. Yeah. Randomly. And they're all scared that it'll land on them. Some sort of slumbering beast. Yeah. But it's actually pretty nice, and when it bursts up, it's like... Yeah, okay. And then it goes down. And if it can't see where it's going when it's digging underground, it ends up like somebody goes down to their basement to like... Yeah. Get something out of the freezer chest, and, and they're like... There's a big giant hand sticking out of their basement. And like, ah! Are you ready to go to turbo paint? Yes. Okay, turbo paint. Away! So, our, we have our hand. I don't, it doesn't have a name. It's just called like, just not, it's like it, the, the thing or something. Like nobody really knows what it is, so they didn't really give it a name. Um, and right now I'm taking my hand off. Bleh. I love that hand too. <laughs> yes. It's sort of that weird like color, that bright generic color that you'd see on like some sort of like dollar store monster or dinosaur or something. Yeah. I love that color. Okay. Well, um, so there's like that mouse, t t or Fred, Fred, right? Wasn't it Fred? Uh, yes, this is Fred. Yes, Fred's just watching like, ha, ah, I could have just been cr crushed and brought down from the ground by that thing. And so he's kind of like, um, just like standing there like, ah, paralyzed because he's so scared. <laughs> and then, um, and then there's like this dude in the window. I'm not sure who he is, but he's just like. Uh, he's just frowning. He's not calling the police. He's not calling Mo Melodic or anything. He's, he's just, just like, like uh, he's just standing in the window going, what is that thing? Like, why? And we've come to the conclusion that that, that is like a hand of a giant monster that digs around at the ground. Yeah, because it's a huge hand. And sometimes, like, in the middle of the night, he'll turn up in someone's garage, or someone's in, like, their garage or in their basement, <laughs> and they'll just be, like, coming down, like, to go check, to go get ice or something, and they'll see a giant hand sticking out, and they'll be like, ah! It's kind of so. like, yeah, the island is getting quite terrifying, because we already have, like, the Cody, the Cody, like, the, the oh, uh, yeah. Yeti-type character walking around. We have Lester... Like He's the hand terrifying. of the dinosaur body, and then we have like the the Fawn Connery, which are. What's that? So, uh, I don't know. I'll, I'll tell you when you're older. No. <laughs> <laughs> Is he over there? No, he's not down there anymore. Um, yeah, great job, Lola. Looks good. Mm -hmm. I like this winter. We'll have to we'll have to come. We'll have to think of a name for this uh, phenomenon. The uh, the subterranean hand. The so, hand of no return. <laughs> the hand of no return. The dirt hand. <laughs> but it's a friendly hand. Yeah, but they don't know. It's the friend. It's the friendly but there's, hand. But it still makes giant holes all around the island that they have to go dig. The bury, refill. Exactly. Refill, yeah. Oh, big problems on the island. <laughs> yeah. All right, guys. Trouble in paradise. I'll see you guys later. Say bye, Lola. Bye.